what's up guys okay y'all today we're gonna be doing a different type of tutorial I ran across this software it's an online software it's totally free guys called photo fuse and it allows you to take a photograph like this one and take the background out so to have a clean um, white background instead of like this one is my shower so it allows you to take it out real quick and easy guys so I want to go over it with you guys and show you how it's done so let's get okay first you're gonna have to of course get online type in the fuse like photofuse.com and then this is the screen you arrive to I log I actually did an account so you could do an account but I think you can test it out without even making an account first um, but I've already made an account so and it's free so I was like trick it I'm gonna do it you know what I'm saying so this is what comes up real easy interface to uh, work with so you all you gotta do is click on this button wait five years huh? and then upload your photo that you want to crop out so as you see my lovely face and we just want the background to be white but of course we want my picture to still be up in center so you take this highlighting tool located right here Let's see if we can zoom in on that. Alright, so the highlighting tool is right here. And so then you can adjust the brush size right here. And you just begin to highlight the area that you want to keep. And so everything that's not highlighted is going to be um, white out. White it out. And right in this area, it gives you a preview of how your image is already going to look. So you see, I only have half a face right there. So that means what? <laughs> okay, so once you have your image completely highlighted, and if you need like to kind of tweak it, you see how over here is, you know, kind of the highlight. But you look at the preview, it don't look like it's affected, but just in case, you have an eraser tool up here. So you just click on the eraser tool, and then you go to the, uh, the area that you want to erase, obviously. And, bam, you erase it. Alrighty. So once you finish highlighting, you just come over here, click on the finish. I have it set up so whenever I'm finished, that it'll send the finished uh, photo to my email. But I'm going to show you what you can do if you don't want to set it up like that. See, it's alerting me. That's what my email is. So then if you like, mm, just from the preview, click on the, the little thumbnail. And you're like, okay, that looks pretty good. If you're happy with this image, then you just click download. And then you can download your image. And then you do your file. So you just say, okay. Also, if you're not happy with this uh, photo, and you're like, man, I need to tweak it a little bit, like over here, you know, I still see a little bit of gray or what have you. Just click back on the photo. take you right back to your already highlighted picture so then you can just take your eraser tool and make your little 
little tweaks. And then click finish again. And you can keep going back and forth, back and forth until it's perfect the way you want it to be. And um, until you're ready to download the fi final picture, then you can click the download. that's good then you can download so I just wanted to show you it's real easy just to go back and forth okay guys I wanted to show you a side by side so that's the before and that is the after guys I think it did an excellent job and if you still needed like a little bit more tweaking you know like maybe around the shoulder area or something you can easily take it into like Photoshop and just make little minor adjustments but hey I think overall I think it did a good job thank you guys for watching this video if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel if you like this video go ahead and hook me up with a thumbs up see you guys next Friday